garden spider. We caught her in the garden in our backyard. And uh, she already built an egg sack when the day after we caught her. It's that this is several weeks ago. And now she's building a smaller one, it seems. Very cool. How cool is that? We call her Charlotte. We that decided to name her Charlotte. See how close that is? It's not as close as I can find it's fuzzy. Yeah. Yeah, that's her old egg sack. She's a new one. cool. How long do the egg sacks? remain there before they... Well, the eggs do not hatch out of the sack until spring. So they're oh, going to wow. stay there throughout winter. And the That's spiders no would actually hatch inside the egg sack uh, at some point, you know, ch uh, going into spring. And then in springtime is when it would come out. So what do we do when they all start pouring out of there? Uh, well, we are, they, since they don't hatch until spring, we'll be done with the unit by the end of October. So I'm going to put this out somewhere, okay. like in the bush somewhere, to, so that they have the winter feeling. And then when they hatch, they hatch. I'll reclaim this towards spring. Maybe we get to come out and watch them balloon, who knows, <laughs> you know. She was at it this morning when we when the kids came in at 8:30 and she's still going and she she's only gotten like probably about half of that done mm -hmm. between that half an hour half of what is now is what she got accomplished She has been eating a lot. She was, has been hungry. When we feed her, she would just run up to the fray. And she must be nourishing, you know, Yeah, I guess it eggs. takes a lot out of her to do this. Yeah. Isn't that cool? Yeah. See, her spinnerets are at the bottom of her abdomen, so it's like in the back end of her. So when you see her raising her back end up, that's when she gets the silk out, and then her back legs are pulling the silk out so that she's weaving the... There we go, there's a good close-up. So does she build it and then drop the eggs in, or are they already at the base and she's building around them? Or? They're not at the base. As we, we, my thinking is, we have never learned how they actually lay the eggs. We just know that they build an egg sack. According to this picture, she's going to lay the eggs from the bottom and then she's going to build around it and then she's going to build the last part of the sack to hold it up. Um, I'm trying to see. I don't think she has laid her eggs in there yet. As far as I can tell, she's still making the egg sack and then she would lay her eggs at the end before okay. she closes it up. You, can you see her spin? Her, look at her legs and then her spinnerets. Very small because she's so tiny, you don't see them. On rodeo rows, you can tell the spinnerets because they're a lot bigger. Yeah. If I, get, if I zoom in too much, it gets fuzzy. And it's fuzzy. Well, Is we're there getting a table, pretty tight. a stand you can put so you don't have to keep holding it? Do you, want, do you have a stand that you want me to go grab? No, that's okay. We can. You could be here somewhere. for a while. <laughs> Shaking her 
foundation here. Actually, this is a good spot for her to for us to be able to wash her when she's starting laying. Okay. Yeah. 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 Yeah.